Hey, we are back for our, well, I guess our first lesson, but our second video. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's a whole... Go through the whole way through the song, are we? Going. That's good. Hello, Mr. Jordan. Oh, hello. Gosh, that was really good. I hope I hope we keep doing that every video. Oh, uh, me yeah. too. Yeah, so it's I was I was saying it's our first lesson, but our second video now. And what what is it? What are we learning today? Oh, OK. So um, in the last lesson, uh, it wasn't really a lesson, but it was more of an introduction. In the last introduction, uh, we told everyone that we were going to be doing a spooky story competition. And hopefully some people have started writing those. Today, we're going to introduce our first feature, which I have behind me here. Over here, you can see if you can see my hand, you can't see my hand. But it says uh, tips for writing a uh, a suspense story. And that's suspense. Really, like we suspense i just think that suspenders like the things that hold your trousers up a suspension bridge is it to do with holding things up is that what we're talking about no 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 suspense is a key feature in horror and spooky stories mr jordan it's making the audience wait oh Gosh, you built the tension up, I've got to say. Okay, absolutely. I that is what it is about. It is about building up to that moment of action. Uh, in this case, because it's a spooky story, you are building up to something spooky happening. Is it one of those kind of <gasps> moments? Is that what we're looking it at? It is one of those kind of <gasps> moments. Absolutely, like Mr. George. Sometimes in our class we go, <gasps> suspense. That's our way of remembering it. That is fantastic. Mm. I'm going to have to start doing that in my class as well. <laughs> yes. Some expense. You are. Right. Our first feature today is over on this side, and it is the top feature uh, over here. Mr. Jordan, could you read that out for us? It says, peak sekentesses to horse. Sorry, keep sentences short. Is that right? Yes, keep sentences short. <clears throat> The shorter the sentences are and the more full stops you use slows down the reader. Wait, I Therefore, thought they, they were... have to wait longer before they get to the scary moment. And if you keep them reading slowly, it builds that suspense and it builds that tension. Now, Mr. Jordan, would you mm. like to have a try at building some spooky short sentences i would but i'm nervous about this mr keeling because the reason i interrupted you over there is i've learned so many things in english fronted adverbials alliteration on a math pair similes all these complex sentences i don't know how i'm going to feel about making it short again okay try just putting that all to one side okay. and go for short go for short go for simple right. and go for spooky okay okay she creepily walked up through the dirt path towards the old creaking... Too long! Oh. Try again. Well, shorter than that. Shorter than that. Okay. You shouldn't really use words like uh, uh, creepily. I mean, that, that is good description, and you might want to put that in some of your longer sentences. But right now, remember, we're trying to keep them short. Okay, so things like adjectives, things like adverbs out of the window. We're really going for the basics here, are we? Absolutely. In fact, your sentence should try to be below 10 words. She crept towards the house. Full stop. Keep going, Mr. Jordan. She leaned into the window. Full stop. It was dark. Full stop. Oh, there was a weird smell. Full stop. A noise echoed from across the corridor. What was that? Question mark. 
something was moving. Is that alive? You know I am, said Grandma. <laughs> I like that. That was very good. Do you know what? No pre-planning, all improvised. That was quite easy to do as well. Absolutely. And you could try that at home. Try it, you know, with a partner. One of you says a short sentence and then somebody else says a short spooky sentence and see if you can build up your own little short scary story before you write it down. I like that. I feel like that's something we've tried to do a lot of, but it was very successful there, wasn't it? That was really good. Absolutely. Um, this is video one in the series over mm. uh, our features. Uh, next time we'll be looking at uh, another one of these behind me. But for now, children, try that. Give it a go. Uh, and don't forget to send us your results. We'll see you next time. May I interrupt one second? When we say send results, we're talking about emailing them to the year group email address. Is that right? That is right, Mr. Jordan. Good. And we'll put a link of those below. Fantastic. See you next time. Bye.